Hi, I'm Nathan Robertson, 33 years old, Olympic badminton player. I'm here as a member of Team 2012, as supported by Visa. London 2012, I hope, should be the sort of biggest and best event that any, especially British athletes, will get the chance to go to. Um, on a personal level, I really hope that London 2012 is sort of the career-ending high that I'm hoping for in my career. Uh, the lead-up to 2011, uh, we've got a lot of tournaments coming up. It, as far as badminton goes, we've got the World Championships in London, actually in the Wembley Arena, which will be used for the 2012 Games. So it's a perfect build-up, the 2011 World Championships in the arena. Hopefully will give us the practice that when we get to 2012 we've got a slight advantage maybe over the other competitors who haven't competed in it before. The strongest nations in badminton are certainly China. Uh, they're very dominant in the sport. Uh, they've got millions and millions of people playing it, so uh, it's a difficult task to beat them, but it's been done in the past. Uh, I'm sure it'll be done again in the future, and um, they, they certainly won't like taking on the British players when it comes to being in London. A typical week's training will normally be about 20 to 24 hours of training during a week. One specific day will be two hours on court. Uh, we normally do two, two to three hours of physical work a day, which will be in the gym doing weight training or out the gym doing CV work, potentially on a bike or running. So it uh, depends on what, what an athlete's preferred method is. I hope all athletes who are part of Team 2012 will you know, see the benef benefits that the, you know, the raising money through Team 2012 and other organisations gives to them. You know, we all want to get the best possible training through coaches, environment, um, strength and conditioning, everything that comes along with being a professional athlete and the money that Team 2012 can bring to the table for the athletes going into 2012 will actually help them achieve their, you know, hopefully medal targets. I hope the 2012 Games will be different to previous Olympics. I think every Games evolves, they all learn from what's been good about, good and bad about the previous Olympics. I think London, you know, is such a huge capital city all over the world. It's renowned for a great culture and I think it will bring that into the 2012 Games. Um, you know, we're very passionate about sport in England also, uh, with football especially, and I think you know, we'll get those fans coming and filling the stadiums during the 2012 Games. My previous partner GLM's retired in uh, 2008 to have a baby, so congratulations to her on that. Uh, my new partner Jenny Warwork, she's uh, 23 years of age, uh, still developing as a player, hopefully to reach her peak in 2012, that's my plan. Uh, and also hers, you know, for her, to, for her it'll be her first Olympic Games uh, and my last, so hopefully they can coincide with uh, a great partnership and potentially getting us on the podium.